What do I see coming for the real estate market in 2019? Well, to first look at that or consider that, I think we have to look and back at 2018. And the volume of sales was the biggest challenge of 2018 because in some neighborhoods they were down upwards of almost 40%. And that means 40% less homeowners brought their home on the market last year when you look at the averages of home sales in our neighborhoods. So why was that the case? Well, I believe that sellers thought the market was gonna go up, buyers thought the market was gonna go down. So we kind of had this flux of stagnant you know, market conditions. So what that usually means is the market will correct itself. So all of those people who didn't sell last year will most likely bring them on this year because really our market isn't necessarily going up, it's not going down, it just is. So instead of waiting, people are just gonna to start to move forward with listing their home. So we've had a pretty strong start in 2019. We just finished this week, we did six deals, four buys, two sales. Our sales, we had great numbers of showings, we got great, we got 99% of lists on both our sales. And our purchases, we were able to negotiate we had a healthy amount of homes to pick from. We got our home inspections. So, I mean, really, on both sides of the spectrum for buyers and sellers, it's almost ideal market conditions. The one thing I'd be cautious about is I do believe more and more homes are gonna be coming on as we get into the spring months. So if you're thinking about selling, right now you might wanna be thinking about getting ahead of the curve rather than being one of maybe four houses in the neighborhood rather than being one of 25. So that's my outlook for 2019. I hope it helps.